guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel, it's Nisha Rogers here and as you can tell by today's title, we're go whoa, that was not English, as you can tell by today's title, we're going to be reviewing the pretty little thing dupe for the Zara denim dress, I'm pretty sure you guys have seen it all over TikTok, I know I have, it's literally been on like AliExpress and all those places, so it's quite a popular dress, so if you're interested in seeing how the dress is going to look on, how the fit is going to be, the quality, the sizing you should get, Make sure you like, comment, subscribe and share. Let's not waste any more time and let's get on into the video. Just arrived today. I haven't opened it because I was waiting to try it on with you guys here. So let's take it out and let's get a feel of the quality. So um, I think on the website it said that the material was a twill, I think. I have some jeans in that material but I just couldn't remember how it felt. So, um, okay yeah, so it feels like a, oh I don't know. I was about to say you guys feel, have a feel. I don't know, like almost, can you hear that? It feels like a very, very, very light denim. But one thing I have already noticed is that it has that plastic thing. So um, obviously it'll help keep the dress up and stop it from like slipping, especially when it gets hot. It has a zipper going down the back. And um, one thing I can say is they actually did a good job of like hiding it because one thing I do not like with certain items of clothing is when like, you can properly see the zipper sticking out of the back. I like that seamless vibe and that's what it's basically given. You can't really see where it is. It's kind of like bunching on the top. I know that the Zara one is a more of a heavy, well from what I've seen on pictures it looks like a more of a heavy denim material. Well heavier than this one. Let's try it on and let's see. Oh yeah I forgot to mention that there is a slip at the back of mini one so it's going to be easy to walk in i'm not sure if the zara one does have that i will double check and put it on the screen but yeah let's get this on let me okay, so go yeah. on as you guys can see one thing i've immediately noticed is that there isn't stretch so parts where i'm a little bit more curvy are it was kind of hard to get on so i would say if you're more on the curvy side then probably size up from your normal size but I don't know because I feel like when I wear things I like it to be more figure hugging especially dresses like this because just imagine it feels a bit more cinched in in the waist and in like certain areas like can you guys see the vision because I know I can but um yeah the only problem is like as I said in more places where I'm curvier it wouldn't fit me properly so if you really did like the dress and you were willing to go get it tailored then definitely like this is your dress also, it says that it's a midaxi dress, and I assume that means somewhere between maxi and a midi dress. But because I'm five foot tall, nothing midaxi is gonna fit like midaxi. It's gonna fit as a maxi dress. It just doesn't really have shape though. Like, let me show you the back. I will post a video alongside so you guys can see the length as well. But yeah, like I don't know how it's looking at the back not me to come on here and like be promoting skims because i'm not getting paid but one thing i do admire about the skims dresses is that the dresses are more contouring on the body so you don't really get like the bunching at the back and in like other areas as well i've seen some no i do feel like this other one has some stretch to it because this one does not have any stretch but yeah um i'm gonna have to give this like a five like it's not bad but it's just not great and I do feel like kind of cautious that it's gonna keep slipping because even though it does have the lining it's not really doing a good job of holding me tight maybe if I did size down perhaps I could kind of squeeze into it and maybe this re this review would be a lot better I'm more positive but no I would say don't waste your money on it I can't lie like unless you're okay with like the loose fit and then by all means but I'm gonna give this a five i don't know if i already said that but it's a five it's not bad but it's not amazing it like it'll get the job done and obviously you can pair this with like some gold accessories or if you could go with like big obnoxious glasses and maybe like a slick back um low bun or even if you want to have your hair down and like back like just to have a bit of the clavicle out but yeah guys this dress really isn't for me and i actually have places to be and i thought okay maybe it's kind of giving no, I think I'm going to have to go on a hunt for the Zara one and we'll see how that one looks like. But if you guys enjoyed this review today, please like, comment, subscribe and share. I promise my reviews aren't always this negative, but I'm going to give you guys the truth. Like, I'm not going to sit here and lie because I don't like when people do that because they'll get me to spend my coin. And then I'm just like, 
girl it does not look anything like you said yeah, if you did enjoy this video make sure you like comment subscribe and share and i'll see you in my next video bye